what's going on everybody? It's ETA Prime back here again with another LaunchBox news video and today we're proud to announce that LaunchBox 11.10 has been released. And like all new releases of LaunchBox and Big Box, there's some fixes, improvements, and new features. In this video, we're mainly going to be going over the new features, but if you're interested in learning about the improvements and fixes, I will leave a link to the changelog in the description so you can go ahead and read through this because as you can see, we do have a lot of fixes and improvements, but for this video, I wanted to cover the new premium features because I'm most excited about this. And all of these new premium features have to do with views inside of Big Box, more specifically wall views and cover flow. And these look absolutely amazing. We're going to take a look at them in just a second with the default theme. And we also have a new custom theme available over on the LaunchBox forum known as POC, Proof of Concept. And the developer of that theme has integrated these new features into the POC theme. So first on the list for new premium features, the big box default wall view has been overhauled and is now much more flexible, with features such as item selections, row fading, and more. Next on the list, there are now four different big box wall views available for theme developers to implement into their new themes. And like I mentioned, the default theme is supporting them right now, and we have that POC theme as of making this video but it's really up to the developers to integrate this into their new themes and existing themes to get these new features built in. Moving down a little bit, all big box wheel and cover flow views have been overhauled to allow custom theme templates inside of each element in the wheel cover flow. This means that theme developers can now use multiple images and other elements inside of the wheel and cover flow items, like videos, which brings me down to the next section. Videos in Big Box can now be easily used inside of wheel, cover flow, and wall view items. And in my opinion, this is really awesome. It looks really good. And finally here, badges can also be added to wheel, cover flow, and wall view items in Big Box. So there's a lot of new changes here with the views inside of Big Box, and this is going to make for some amazing themes down the road. Now, like I said, if you're interested in reading through this, link will be in the description. But now I want to move over to Big Box and show you these new features. All right, so here we are with Big Box, and I'm using the default theme. So I'm going to head to Theme Specific Options, Default, because that's the one I want to make changes to, Views, and my Games List view. I'm going to go ahead and set this to Wall View Number 2. I'll just back out of here, and I'll just go into Super Nintendo. So here's our new wall view with videos integrated. So as you can see, I have it set up with a little bit of clear logo. And inside, it'll start playing the video for me. Really love the way this is set up. I think it looks really good. And I've always been a big fan of wall view. I just wanted a couple more features, and now we definitely have them. So we got those videos integrated here. This is wall view 2 in the default theme. Let's back up and change this to another new wall view. We're going to go with wall view 3, and this allows us to add favorites. And we'll just stick with Super Nintendo. So at the very beginning here of my list, as you can see, I have these stars. These are three games that I have favorited, and they've moved up to the top of my list. So if I want to, let's say, favorite something else, I do want to find a really good game, but uh, we'll just go with Barbie. I'm going to mark this as one of my favorites. And once we're reloaded, you can see that it's now added to the top of my list. It just makes it a lot easier to find those games in the wall view that you want to play without having to do a search or anything like that. So that's another new feature, and this is the default theme with wall view 3. Now I'm going to swap over to the new proof of concept theme. So I'll go to manage themes, and this is available on the LaunchBox forum. I'll leave a link for it in the description, but we have the POC, the proof of concept. Apply is my main theme. I'll go to theme specific options, views, and I'm going to set this to wall view number one. And from here, we'll just swap over to N64. And here it is. So yeah, I'm a big fan of this theme here, especially this wall view. As you can see, over on the right hand side, we have our boxes. We're in N64 right now. Over on the left hand side, we have our details and video playing right there. Just makes it really easy to see what you're going to get into if you've never played the game before. And uh, like I mentioned, I've always been a big fan of these wall views, but we needed a little more out of them, and I think now we have it. And there's one more view I want to show you here in the POC theme. I'll do wall view 2. 
We'll just stick with N64 here. And here we go. So again, we have videos implemented. And one thing I really like about the way this is set up, as you can see, we have that clear logo, but the clear logo fades away once the video starts. So it gives us a clear view of that gameplay going on right there. So yeah, I think this looks really, really good. And the possibilities are endless to theme developers now with wall views and cover flow. I just can't wait to see what these developers come up with. I know we're gonna have some pretty crazy themes coming up really, really soon. So yeah, when it comes to the LaunchBox version 11.10, there's some awesome new premium features, but we kind of got to wait just a little while to get these theme developers on board to implement all of these new premium features. But if we give it just a little bit of time, I'm sure we're going to see some amazing themes come out of this. So that's going to wrap it up for this one. We really appreciate you watching and hope you enjoy version 11.10. We definitely have more coming down the road, so stay tuned to the channel. If you have any questions, let us know in the comments below. And like always, thanks for watching.